Hello there, humans and non-humans, I suppose. Anyway, this is Frostclaw140, and I bring you the... I'm gonna... I'm doing this with a voice just so that the pronunciations are clear. Sorry about not clarifying it. The Mistiverse Cup Results. Well, you guys, I can't talk. I'm sorry. Anyway, results of Mistiverse. We're gonna start from characters with the least screen time. Well, maybe. I haven't exactly storyboarded everything yet. This is just a rough estimation. Um, anyway. Um, least amount of screen time to most amount of screen time. By my estimations. This is probably not going to be accurate. Anyway, starting out with the part of Saber Fangs. This person was fabulous. Loved their audition. It was awesome. Anyway, the part of Saberfangs goes to, sorry if I mispronounce anyone's name here, just heads up, Joe Dwyer. You were cool. Yay. Go Joe. And next up, Sunrise. This guy was really hard to choose because people were so good at him. Because he's freaking adorable. Yeah. Anyway, the part of Sunrise goes to Lady Jane 2876. You go, girl. And then, next up is Darwin. The part goes to Mr. Wilson of the AP Econ class. Shout out to my homies. Yay. Sorry if it wasn't really the AP Econ class. Oh well. Anyway, next up is uh, Crow. Okay, we're getting up to seriously main characters here. Well, not seriously main, but main for this section of the series. The part of Crow goes to Joe Dwyer. You get two parts, you lucky duck. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're awesome. You just have the best crazy psychotic male guy character. Wait, male guy? Anyway, let's not dwell on my insanity. Let's dwell on... Crow's insanity. Anyway, yeah, he's not really insane. He's just weird. Next up, Web. I got a lot of auditions for her too. This is pretty hard to dis to decide. Sorry, I cannot talk humans. Anyway, the part of Web goes to Inway to Lamnar. Clap, 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 clap. Good job. And then now, the person. Well, the character who had the most auditions, by far, Fifla. The person who got Fifla's part is awesome, and is Jade Wolf Eleven. LOL. Yay, you go, girl. And last, but certainly not least, the part of Ifla, who actually got like one of the least amount of auditions. Well, I mean, aside from, like, the adult male parts, but that's understandable. Anyway, the part of Ifla goes to Yukio Hide Yoshi. You, like you said, you did take a little while to get the audition in, but it was worth it. Good job. Anyway, to those of you who didn't get a part, I will PM you when I need you as an extra or a side character. But, you know, you were all amazing, so... It hurts me on the inside not to give you at least a little bit of a part in this series. So, those of you who tried out and did not get a part, I'll probably be getting you as an extra or a side character. Maybe. I also have some friends, believe it or not. <laughs> anyway, I'll be seeing you all soon. Have fun. To my voice actors, I'll be sending you the script via or via whichever country you're in. Um... PM. I will PM you the script. Bye.